Hello everybody! Welcome back to more video game testing. Let's not waste any time and jump straight into our first game of today's video, which is... If I can find it, because this is not a random selection today, because I know what the first game is going to be. I just can't find it. There it is! F-Zero X on the Nintendo 64. Hell yeah, dude! Let's start off a bit differently for today's episode and change things up a bit with an actually good game. Hell yeah, let's jump into it! Holy shit, guys, you have no idea how excited I am for this game right now. I've never played an F-Zero game before in my life, so when I saw this sitting there staring at me in the cash converters, I just... I just had to get it, okay? Man, there's so many vehicles in this. Obviously someone has played the hell out of this and unlocked everything. Anyway, let's just let's just stick with the standard Captain Falcon because it's the only F-Zero character that I know. This game has awesome music. I'm, I already figured that out. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. And like, look how many people are in the race as well. There's 30 other races. Like... It always pisses me off in, in racing games, where it's like, oh, there's only eight races per race, and there's only four some, sometimes. This game has 30, you know. I can totally appreciate how awesome that is. This is awesome, I like this. I just wish I knew how to, like, really, like, win. Because <laughs> this is a bit lame. If I'm just going to come in, like, 10th every race, that's a bit shit. Look at all these races, man! It's so packed! Like, the courses have a very simple design, but it works because there's so many other, like, races that you're in the, that are on the track, so... I don't know how to go fast. <laughs> I'm just holding the button and hoping that I win. <laughs> boost power! Boost power! How the fuck do I boost, though? Oh, there we go! There's my boost power, right. The, the B button. I should have known it was the, one of the face buttons. <laughs> now we're fucking playing F-Zero. Look at this shit. We're flying. Now we're... Look at this shit. We're flying down the track now. Whoa! What was that? Alright, now I know what I'm doing. Oh my god! Collision! <laughs> That's so fucking awesome. Come on, go! Whoa! <laughs> Oh no! I died? Oh man, I drove too close to the edge. I went over the line. Boost! Fourth! That's the best race I've had so far. Here we go. Fly, I boost past you. I miss that goddamn turbo pad. There's too, there's too much blast processing in this game. I can't keep up with it. My tiny human brain isn't, isn't strong enough to, to withstand the effects of F-Zero. Just cannot hit anything. Do not hit anything. Do not hit anything. Do not hit anything. Do not hit anything. I'm shitting myself right now. Oh my god, I've got no health. Ah! Health, yes. Yes, come on. I come first! Holy shit! Alright! God, that's awesome. <laughs> I mean, also hearing... That's the other thing with this that I probably should have been prepared for, but I wasn't. I'm hearing so much familiar music that, like, I've heard all over the place, but just didn't know what game it was from. It's obviously from this. <laughs> Oh god, these turn, these like hair, these like S turns. I don't know how to do them. Just, oh, this is gonna be a bad track for me. There's no way I'm getting a good score on this one. Whoa! Where is the course? Oh, there it is. Okay, that was weird. You just gotta know when to hit those like. Ah, oh, drift. <laughs> Oh no, I'm dead. I hit too many walls. Oh, look at that drift! <laughs> <laughs> All 
right, this is the corner here I always get killed on. Oh no! I got killed on it! Alright, let's do this, let's do this, let's do this, let's do this! I'm pumped, I'm ready! This is gonna be it, guys. I hope you're ready to see greatness in action. Oh, look at that! He's moving through the ranks! Watch your back! I gotta heal up, I gotta heal up. This is awesome, like the, this balancing of of boosts and like ch and um, shields, it works so well. Like it's so risk reward. Like I love it. Oh, risk, <laughs> risky. <laughs> there wasn't much reward from that risk. Jesus. Here we go, boosts. Come on. Oh, second. Holy shit! I got second. Man, I had so much fun with that. I cannot believe it. F0X. What a fucking game, man. That was awesome. I even got some good some good positions. Like for first time ever playing this game, I think I did pretty good on some of those more difficult tracks. Holy shit, people. I have zero confidence that we'll be able to top this game in today's episode, but we have to at least try. So, let's move on to game number 2, which is Ooh, Castlevania Judgment on the Nintendo Wii. Now, I don't know anything about this game, but it's Castlevania, so it has to be pretty awesome, right? It does look very anime, which is not really my thing, but fuck it, let's give it a go. I'll have to set up the Wii, but sure, this, this has got to be good, right? This has got to be good, it's Castlevania. I accidentally put the game in upside down. Okay, now we've fixed that problem. <laughs> we might actually be able to play the game. Can you really not navigate the Wii menu with the GameCube controller? That's so stupid. What's the point of the GameCube controller then? I may as well just use this shit, right? All right. Anyway, let's check out Castlevania Judgment. Castlevania Judgment. Yeah, that's what I just said, bro. Alucard looks pretty badass. I don't know a lot of Golem's here too. <laughs> Holy shit, Golem's huge. Let's just go, let's just go Simon Belmont. Keep it simple. In this place, I too am able to Who the hell is that? Round one. Wait a minute. Ready? This is a fighting game? Fight. Holy shit! Waggle! <laughs> Come on! What the fuck? This, I was not ready for this. I can tell you right now. What the fuck am I playing? Holy shit! Crack the whip! <laughs> this is terrible. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Oh my god. What? How the hell are you supposed to play this with the Wiimote? There's no chance. It's so slow as well. <laughs> Fia! Look at that cool combo, it did nothing. There we go, that's a combo! Oh, come on, Simon. <laughs> Man, I'm tired. <laughs> I can't even get near him, let alone hit him. Hit him, he doesn't react. Right, I think we need the controller. <laughs> I think we need the GameCube controller. Jesus Christ. Fight. I'm already doing so much better with the controller. <laughs> like, I'm still not good. But at least I can do moves. God, how's this person not ended me yet? I just got him in a good rhythm there and killed them so bad. Oh, Jesus. Fucking Christ. I haven't even done a single hit of damage to them. Are you kidding me? Away with you! Away with you! Did nothing. <laughs> what the hell's happening? Whoa! Look at that shit! What the fuck just happened? And he's fine. <laughs> it's like, next round. <laughs> like, how is it not over? No! <laughs> You're kidding me. Even after that epic 97 hit combination super move, I still lost the battle. 
That is some bullshit. We're done here. All right, let's go with Alucard. Yeah, Alucard's moveset is really shitty. Not a fan, guys. Whoa! I'm cool. I'm a fan of that, though. That was cool. Obviously, I don't know any of the moves, but, like... This is clearly not one of those fighting games where you can just be shit and spam buttons and still hold your own. Oh shit, I did a super move by total accident! Here we go! Whoa! <laughs> this is awesome! K.O. <laughs> you just win instantly! How the hell did I do that? I am sort of figuring it out a little bit. Like, the longer I play, the more I'm sort of fluking cool shit happening. But I still don't know what's going on, dude. Too weak. Oh, that was a cool combo, I think. Don't even do a combo, though. He keeps blocking everything. Oh, I fell off a cliff! God damn it. Well, guys, I certainly wasn't expecting a fighting game when I put this in, but it's a surprisingly competent fighting game. It's just a shame that I'm incompetent when it comes to fighting games, but I would love to learn how to do some of the moves and give this more of a go in the future. But for today, we've only got time for one more game, and that game will be... Sim Animals. Again, on the Wii. This is, this is going to be a change of pace, I think, from what we've had in the previous games. But, Sim Animals, let's give it a go. I'm not sure how familiar you guys are with The Sims franchise, but whenever you would play a video game or watch the TV in The Sims, it would show footage from other EA licensed games. Like, um, I think Burnout was one of them, SSX was always in there. But there was always this, like, animal game. And I found out during a live stream of The Sims that it was Sim Animals. Um, so I also have to thank Petronius for sending this in. Thanks, mate. We're going to be checking this game out, finally, after years of seeing it in The Sims and wanting to give it a go. Um... Looking at this, I don't really know why I wanted to play it, <laughs> to be perfectly honest. Welcome to Sin Animals. Let us teach you a few basics about the game. Wave your hand quickly over the tree to shake off the acorns. Like that. At the top of the screen and holding A. The point of the backpack. Fucking hell. There's no way I'm going to remember all this. Oh shit. Oh, it's a squirrel! What a cutie! <laughs> Alright. The squirrel was attracted by the acorns. Press, the, pick the squirrel up. Come on, get back here, little fucker! Yeah! <laughs> now shake the squirrel! <laughs> I promise I'm... I promise I'm not a sicko. That's just the first thing I... That's the first thing that came to my mind. Right. <laughs> The squirrel doesn't like you much. It's hungry. Grab an acorn and drop it on the squirrel. Drop it on the squirrel. There you go, buddy. Hey, he likes it. Ah, oh, he loves me. Wave your hand over it quickly to give it some fun. Ha uh ha. -huh. I can pet the squirrel. Oh, he likes the butterflies. Man, this game. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck's going on. Since the squirrel fully trusts you, you can drop it in your backpack. <laughs> Come with me, little fucker. <laughs> Get in there. <laughs> Just jamming it in the backpack. Oh, yep, uh, acorns have attracted a robin. Look at the squirrel. <laughs> Why is there a squirrel fighting in the... Eat the fucking acorns, you stubborn asshole. Now, though. Oh, shit. <laughs> drop the tree on him. He likes it. Oh, is he going to attack the squirrel? <laughs> Are they going to duel? Are they going to, like, face off now? Oh, they love each other! Isn't that cute? Oh, shit! <laughs> sure, I got a new area. <laughs> I don't know what I did, but I earned it. So I guess you just go around <laughs> befriending animals like goddamn Snow White. I thought you would have been building, like, an animal city or some shit. <laughs> Can you make it move in? This rabbit needs fun. Make it trust you. His camera is broken. It's a real issue. Like, fucking Wiimote nunchuck camera. Awesome. How do I, how do I make it love me? 
How do I make the rabbit love me? Why doesn't anyone love me? Come on, you little fuck, have fun. <laughs> you know, this game has like a real zen about it. I can see the appeal, but there's just not really much happening. And so I'm kind of sick of it. Well, guys, I think we'll call it there for Sim Animals. It's it's a pretty pretty relaxing game to end off today's episode, but man, what a whopper episode. F-Zero was radical as fuck, and Castlevania Judgment was a lot of fun too, especially when I was able to actually get some special moves to work. But yeah, this was a good episode, so I am happy, and I hope you're happy too. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and share. I'm Square Eye Jack, and I hope you have a great fucking day. Thanks for watching.